By all means, let's hear it. It's the least I could do since you already helped me grant one final wish for my last worshippers. They were suffering so from vampirism and begged me for a cure. Then you came and ended their misery. I couldn't have planned it better myself. So, what's your heart's desire? What kind of deal can we strike? Ah, uh, that insufferable pup! Forget it! Request denied! No deal! I'm glad to be rid of him. Even if it does mean I'm stuck in this pitiful shrine in the back end of nowhere. Well, perhaps there is a way he could earn this place back at my side. Maybe, but no promises. There's an axe. An incredibly powerful axe. An axe powerful enough for me to have quite a bit of fun indeed. If you bring it to me, I'll grant you my boon. No strings attached, no messy surprises. At least not for you. As I recall, it's resting in Rhyme Rock Burrow. Barbers can lead you right to it. Little Mutt might even earn his place back at my side. Ah, you've got the axe. And my dog. Splendid. Excellent work. A hero and his faithful companion retrieving the ancient artifact for the prince. It's almost storybook. Ah, oh, but it almost seems a shame to give a weapon like that away, doesn't it? I suppose I could be persuaded to let you keep it. But only if you use the axe to kill Barbus. Simple as that. And I could absorb the spirit of poor dead Barbus. He'd still be reunited with me. And I'm sure Barbus doesn't want me to have that axe. He wants it this way. The choice is yours, friend. We're all counting on you to make the right decision. Put him out of our misery. Absolutely. Now I can reabsorb his body and return to full power, all without having to listen to his whining. Oh, sure, he'll be back in a century or two. But think of the fun I can have till then. Enjoy that axe, and don't worry about poor old Barbers. After all, he really should have picked a better friend. 